Hey guys, well, just another rainy day video. As you can see, it's not raining out today, it's snowing and raining. Just great. Anyway, I got a couple more projects on the go. This is my um, photon style FPV plane um, that's built after uh, Experimental Airlines. Um, Ed's ideas. Uh, with his photon, uh, pretty much the same thing, only a couple little other little things I added. Um, I bought these landing gear at the local hobby store and uh, put them on to give it something to land on. And at the top, where the motor mounts, um, I'm using a Turnigy 1240 KV 2826, I believe. Um, I made a little kind of an air. I don't know, foil, I guess you could call it here, um, just in front of the motor so the wind wouldn't be hitting just the back of the motor. This kind of gave it something to uh, to flow along and also supports the motor. I noticed in, just in some tests that uh, my aluminum motor mount uh, wiggled around a bit and pushed forward, changing the pitch of the prop because you need a bit of uh, down angle on this plane, about 5 degrees to get it to fly right. So uh, I made this little foam piece here just out of that blue core foam. Uh, cut it out, sanded it down just to kind of match the taper and then covered it with tape and taped it on the top of the wing here just to give some support um, for the back of the motor. Now the motor um, has something to uh, push against and it doesn't change the the angle of the motor. So I've just got some little finishing touches to put on that. I'm waiting for the receiver. I'm going to put one of those um, orange RX uh, stabilizers in here. Um, I've got one on my my uh, other little plane up there, my FMS um, Easy Star, I think it is. Um, flies really great with that. So I'm just waiting for the uh, receiver to finish testing this out. This is the the hatch here um, where my rec receiver and the st flight stabilizer is going to go. Um, I put a couple popsicle sticks top and bottom just to reinforce the fuselage around here uh, so it wouldn't crinkle on hard landing or anything um, so I'll just tape that shut once I've got the uh, receiver and everything in there ready to go and it's ready to, to for its first flight testing and also I started on my tricopter this is um, the same as the flight test tricopter design I got the um, the plates from um, Dave Vindestol's uh, website rcexplorer.se now they have them on flight test you can order them there but I got them from there and so just waiting for the receiver for this and um, a couple of things to finish up I've got to program the ESC's with the Simon Key firmware and I'm running Sunny Sky um, 980 KV 2212 Dash 13 motors. These are awesome. They're the same ones I use on my quad. Really nice quality, smooth, powerful. And I've got a variety of propellers I'm going to try out with this as well. So the only thing I'm getting to fly right now is my little ladybird. Because I can fly it here in the garage. Doesn't matter the weather. And just practice my skills and have some fun. I'm going to put the, I've got a KK2 board here for that tricopter as well. So, lots on the agenda, just waiting for some actual flying weather. Because this is just downright depressing. Anyway, hope you guys have some better weather and uh, are actually out there uh, having some fun. Take care, thanks.